Okay, so I'm going to, um, I've got here a um, Andromeda Galaxy to process for a Style Tools for Beginners group member. Um, I'm going to open it with the second option as I normally do. Okay, I'm going to bin 50% Right now, auto dev to see roughly what we've got and any stacking artifacts. Looks like there may be frame overlap there, but we might get away with that. So we'll keep that, and now we need to crop. Um, I'm just going to crop off a relatively small area and then cut some of that out, some of that gradient there. Now we need to wipe. I'm going to stick with the gradient wipe, bring the dark and non normally up to three, select auto temp dev. Yeah, there is a frame overlap there. Doesn't seem to affect it too much, so we'll keep it. Now I'm going to rotate it on 80 so it's sort of the right orientation. And go to develop. Drop the camera down on 10 as I always do. And Dark and Nom up to 15. That looks good to start. So let's go and see what we'll do a bit of colour first. And if I remember I bought this up to around about four. It's just a matter of playing with these, see see how it turns out. <coughs> That galaxy looks good, the stars are too saturated, so I'm going to create a star mask. I'm going to raise this up to 
15 or so and see how we go. I want to leave it on flood fill and see if we can Okay, I've got quite a good style mask there, so I'm going to invert that. <coughs> Keep. And uh, we should get the same result with the styles not oversaturated. Bring the dark up a bit. It's looking nice. I'm going to try that max. <coughs> it looks really nice. So keep that for a second now. I wanna do the stars, so I'm gonna invert the mask. And then go back to the colour <coughs> and see what keep mask. See what So we've got to reduce the red. And reduce the saturation. It's really nice. That's yes, good data. Not having to do too much of this at all, but what I'm going to try now and clear the mask. Um, actually, I'm going to save that. That's a good star mask. And clear, invert, and keep. And I'm going to try and filter out some of the which it click would reject, and we want to filter out some of this gradient around here. See what happens. Mm -hmm. um, we click on the orangey colour that will reject those pixels. Um, okay, cancel that for a second and then try a contrast. That's better. Uh, No. So, mask. Clear. Now I'm going to get lasso. And I'm going to do a rough, <coughs> a rough lasso of that area. Keep that. Then I'm going to 
go to filter reject mask fuzz maximum and try that rejecting pixels again <coughs> right, let's try a bit of HDR reveal all, which is the reset, put that up to maximum, turn it down. I don't really like that, so I'm going to try to optimize. That highlights these you know, gases and bits quite nicely. That keep <coughs> right, so. Don't really need to do a hell of a lot more to that. Just picked up some nice, nice detail in there. So the the less you could do, the better it's going to be, really. So I'm going to go to tracking now and do a noise reducing. <coughs> That's quite smooth. Next, and I'll uh, pause. <coughs> okay, so I normally bring that up by a couple to smooth and smooth it out a bit. Nice job, so keep that. And now we go to mask and open up that star mask. Mask. Open. Grow it once. Invert it. Keep. Now we <coughs> sharp. Large. Too much, fifty per cent. Good. Back to sharp, medium. Probably do fifty per cent on this again. Okay. 
no más and then one more small keep this on 100% Very fine difference, but it definitely sharpens it up nicely. Keep so it's looking really nice. Yeah, looks good. Now save that and or try carrying on a bit more, and you can. Uh, just see what happens with develop. If we bring the camera up a bit, brighten it up, it might start to show you bits of gradient. So you could go back into um, the filter, the mask, yeah. Using lasso, let's leave a bit of area. It's got that gradient in it. So we've got to be a little flash. the mask files. I'm looking for the gradient colour. Big improvement. Safe. <laughs> One other little trick, um, mask. If we open our star mask, star, star, there we are. Keep that and go to magic and shrink. We can just reduce the stars a bit. So it makes the galaxy stick out a little bit more. There we go. 